Greetings and welcome to the sixth video in a series on creating cluster column charts using Microsoft Excel. This very short video looks at rearranging the order of a data series within a category on the category axis. When Excel creates a chart with multiple data series, it arranges the data series within a category in the same order as the data series appears on the worksheet. Let's take a quick look at how to rearrange the data series within a category. Let's start by looking at an example of a chart. The chart has four categories, low-end desktops, mid-level desktops, and high-end desktops. Each of the categories has four data series associated with it. The data series are Michigan, Ohio, Indiana, Illinois. Notice that the order of the data series within each category is the same as they appear on the worksheet. For example, the Michigan data series is the first bar in each of the categories and it appears first on the worksheet. The Illinois data series is the last bar within each category and it appears last. So let's change the order of the data series within a category so that the Michigan and Illinois data series are in the center of the category with the Michigan data series on the left and the Illinois data series on the right. The Ohio data series will be on the left side of the category and the Indiana will be on the right side of the category. To start, we'll need to open up the Select Data Source window. In this example, let's use a chart's context menu to do this. 1. Right-click the chart. The chart activates and the chart's context menu appears. 2. On the context menu, click Select Data. The Select Data Source window appears. Notice on the left side of the window, in the Legend Entries Series section, the list of data series, and the Up button and the Down button. 3. On the Select Data Source window, click the series to move. For this demonstration, let's click the Michigan Data Series. Since we want the Michigan Data Series to be the second series on the left within each category, we will need to use the Down button to move it into position. 4. Click the Down button. On the Select Data Source window, observe that the Michigan Data Series moves down to the second position on the list. On the chart, notice that the Michigan column moves to the second position in each of the categories. Now, let's move the Illinois data series to the third position within each of the categories. 5. On the Select Data Source window, click the series to move. In this example, let's move the Illinois data series up to the third position on the list on the Select Data Source window and to the third position within each of the categories. 6. Click the Up button. On the Select Data Series window, observe that the Illinois data series moves up to the third position on the list. On the chart, notice the Illinois column moves to the third position within each of the categories. 7. Click the OK button. In this very short video, you learned how to change the positioning of columns within a category using the Select Data Source window. In the next video in the series, looks at filtering the chart's data series. If you have any questions or comments, please feel free to put them in the comment section below. Until the next video, best wishes.